Hello everyone, it's Robert again with Sparkfun Electronics. And of course, it's Friday, so that means another new product post. So let's see what we've got for this week. Here we've got a very interesting new board. This is actually the Pro Mega. This is the Mega version of the Arduino Pros that we've been selling. As you can see, it's the same form factor as the Arduino Mega. It has all the pin configurations, so you can use this with Arduino Mega shields and regular Arduino shields. The only real difference here is, of course, it doesn't have a USB on here, so you would use an FTDI or a um, Atmega 8U2 breakout board, and it does have a battery connector. We have not populated the um, DC barrel jack here, and this board is meant to operate at 3.3 volts, so you can use this directly with a LiPo battery, which is pretty nice. The other thing to note is because this is a 3.3 volt board, you will need to modify something in your Arduino IDE so this gets recognized as a mega. But we have the directions on the product page for that. So if you're looking for a little bit more power and more pins and something portable, you might want to check out the Mega Pro. So here we've got conductive fiber. Now this differs a little bit from the conductive thread and the conductive fabric that we carry. This is just the actual raw material. This is made from stainless steel and it's actually relatively soft and pretty pliable. Um, what you would do with this is you would use this to weave your own conductive thread or weave your own conductive yarn. You can use this to combine with other materials so you can get kind of um, different resistances and things like that. You could even combine it with another material and make your own felt if you want. So if you're looking for some raw conductive material, check out this. Here we've got a five meter length of fiber optic cable. Fiber optic cable is really interesting because you pass light into it and you get the light out on the other end. This particular cable is about three and a quarter millimeters in diameter and has 64 fibers inside of it. So when you cut it, it looks a little something like that. It has all these fibers. So we've got an LED shrink wrapped into one end of it and we'll show you what it looks like when we attach a battery. And as you can see, the light passes through and we can see it most on the tips. It doesn't diffract that much onto the actual fibers themselves. So you can use this for a lot of different applications. And because this comes in a five meter length that you can easily cut with a pair of scissors, strip back the jacket, there's a lot of applications for this. So here are our products for this Friday. As always, we've got more new products, so definitely check out the homepage and check out the rest of the new products we have. Next week, we're gonna have a very special new product video, so check that out next week, in addition to a couple other videos that we're gonna have next week. So definitely check out the homepage every day, and we'll see you again next week with another Friday new product post.